Hey guys, it's Twitter on Maxwell and welcome to another video where we're going to be looking at the development of a Wonder Kid from FM16. Again, looking at one that was in last year's game, we are looking at another Norwegian, which is Christopher Agea. He's just as good as last year, guys. He is absolutely phenomenal. Now, look at him here. Valued pretty low, 375k. He's still at start in Norway. And you can see there he starts. The mentals are absolutely phenomenal. Some of it's 17 again. Great determination, which always is good for your improvement. Aggression, anticipation, composure, decision making, concentration, all those kind of things. Leadership, off the ball positioning, all at 14s is roughly. Good teamwork, good work rate. And even the physical side of things, 15 strength, you know, they could easily go up to 20. He just lacks a bit of pace. Even technically, though, good technique. There's a good base there for first touch and passing. Um, he, he pretty much turn him into any kind of midfielder you want. You know, he's the, can play defensive midfield, can play central or attacking. Just depends what kind of attributes you get him working on. One thing I will say, I tried to sign him at West Ham, and he would not come. So it's going to be a lot harder to get him to smaller clubs. Unlike last year, you could take him to most places. And at the start of the game, a lot of big clubs are after him. As you can see here, Arsenal, Chelsea, Liverpool, and Man United all looking to bring Christopher Ajer in. And this time after one season, Wait till you see this, 7 years down the line. So here is Christopher Agier at the age of 24. He's went on to get 47 caps for Norway, scoring 9 goals. And he's on 155k a week, which isn't too bad. Uh, valued at £37 million, pounds, done in the colours of Madrid. And just look at him, he's turned into a well-rounded midfielder. Again, still room to improve. You know, great technique, the passing's good, the first touch is good. Heading's pretty decent as well. I think they've probably moulded him into a decent register or even just a deep line playmaker. But it's really the mental and the physical side where he really shines. His lowest mental is flair at 11. If you take that away, you're talking bravery, but everything else, he's a great leader. You know, he get great vision, teamwork, work rate's pretty good, good composure. Decisions and determination are amazing as well. He just honestly looks like somebody that could just be just perfect to sit deep, pick up passes, and launch counter attacks. He's strong as well, 18 strength, good stamina at 16, great at jumping reach at 19, and he's a fit boy at uh, 16 natural fitness as well. Tireless midfielder, said by the media, he likes to dictate the, the tempo of the game, avoid using his weaker foot, as you say, he likes to switch about other flanks, so he'll get the ball deep and punt it out to the other flank. And if we have a quick look at the scout report as well, Odyssey sees him as a four star player, and this is to Arsenal, so obviously he sees him a really high standard player. World class player, highly professional, as it says his strongest attribute is his ability to leap off the ground. He's very versatile, he's spirited, great consistency. So they have him down as something that's really good in the air, so he could be somebody that could be, you know, a, a threat at set PCs, whether it be, you know, free kicks or corners, you know, just that guy you wouldn't expect to be getting your goals for the kind of places, but getting your goals um, and, getting, and causing trouble. So it seems to me, like, as I said uh, earlier on, won't go to any club. You know, like, and here he's moved to Roma for 1.9. I'd say Roma's a really big club, but that also included a loan spell back at start as well. It wasn't until 2017-18 he started playing regularly for Roma. Two breakout seasons there in the first team, playing most games, getting 7.4 ratings roughly. Comes to Madrid for 35.5 million. Okay, first season, you know, great attributes, uh, great start, sorry, with a 7.44. But look at the last season there. 13 goals, 10 assists, an average rating is 7.72. And I remember Odegaard is in Madrid in this save, and I'm thinking, holy crap, that is a team. And um, wow, the fact that Norway's got both of them. But yeah, it's the same this year. Uh, Christopher this year, absolutely phenomenal. And I would definitely recommend, if you can, picking him up like last year. So thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed the video, hit that like button. If you've got any comments, did you this year, last year? Are you going to buy them this year? Let me know as well. And until next time, this is Twitter on Maxwell. I'll speak to you all real soon. Bye-bye.